think you, you need to talk to her some more. I try. And, and what, what, did, what did she do? She, she lashed out at you, right? She probably said some really, really harsh things. You know why she said those things to you? Because she could. You're closer to her than anyone in the world. You were the one guy that she knew that she could express herself to. All that grief and all that anger because she knew that you would never abandon her or judge her. All you would do is keep loving her. No matter what. And that's the truth. Drinking again? No. <laughs> Just so upset about Holly that I'm only the weakness I held. I ordered, ordered it. Oh, I wish. I wish I could say I'm sure. <laughs> and I would have taken a step. <laughs> your sleeve it may be too little too late besides every other stunt you pulled is blown up in your face mm, so true oh i thought you'd left the country i guess it was too much to hope for a permanent relocation mm. jack can i talk to you in private please thank you so how do you worry i i know that the voters are smart enough to see them for the shameless opportunists that they are. But with the two of them, I don't know. I think you should always be worried. JJ. The clock is ticking. I, I, I need to make a decision. Don't do it. Bailey. Don't let them win. What, what are you saying? You, you, you think I should blow off me? Oh, I, I think that you should let this play out. Oh, and let her go public with that recording? JJ, my life is about to blow up, and I can't let Trip or Claire be collateral damage, especially, especially after what they've done for me. So I'm going to have to do whatever it takes to protect them. If, if you, you, you'll be deported. I, I, don't, I don't want that to happen. I know. I know, me neither, JJ, but I don't have a choice. Haley, really think about this. Before you do something you might, you might regret the rest of your life. to thank you. We were fierce competitors in the mayor's race, but that never stopped you from speaking out in support of my sister. And I truly appreciate that. And what I said, she deserves to live in peace. I don't know if voters even care what I think anymore, but 